it's uh, the same vacuum as yesterday. Um, and I just want to reiterate with these nests, it's all about the placement, like nesting trees where they're just kind of hanging from like a limb, kind of swinging freely. Um, it's a lot easier um, for them to swarm out no matter what vacuum you're using, no matter what method, just because um, it's higher up and, you know, there's nothing anchoring the nest. But whereas this, I could just kind of set the ladder up, put the hose to the vacuum as you saw, and just kind of get them as they swarmed out and the ones coming back just got sucked up. So um, it's not really a, a fault of the vacuum, it's more a fault of the, the nest location, um, depending on how much of a swarm you get. And then also when I'm filming, I'm only using one hand because um, I'm holding my phone with the other hand so I'm vacuuming with one hand and filming with the other so it's a little bit trickier but yeah as you can see uh, worked uh, pretty well so far I'm not done yet but all the suds they'll go where the suds are but so yeah that's what we're dealing with all right so oh it's a lot calmer now the nest was and here's the nest Interesting, they did start a second film, but it's on the side, as you can see with this nest. Interesting, usually they're in the center, but this one is built. You see it's off to the side there. Very interesting. And the queens would be in the, this comb. Males and workers are reared in this comb. Queens and some males are reared in this one. And they could have a third and fourth comb, and then it's just queens and some males in those, but all the workers and some males are reared in uh, this uh, top comb. Because the nest is normally facing this way. So, as you can see, the smaller comb, second comb, is on the bottom. So that's why I call this one the top comb. Okay, thanks for watching. Stay safe and healthy. Hopefully you uh, have a better understanding of the vacuuming system. Um, and stay cool. July the 30th, 2020. Bye-bye. Right. On to the next job. Have a good one.